Hey, what's up? It's Jared with State of Tech, and this is the Vava SSD Touch. It is a solid state drive that comes in a 512, one terabyte, or two terabyte option, and it's unlockable at the scan of a fingerprint, just like a smartphone. It has a little pad here where you put your thumbprint or your fingerprint and it will unlock it. Otherwise, it stays locked, which I think is absolutely fantastic. Of course, there are ways to do this with software, and a lot of times you have to have that software installed on your computer in order to get them to unlock, but having a fingerprint scan on here is just game changing, and I think something that is going to add a new layer of security to your solid state drives. So solid state drives are great because there's no moving parts, they're shock resistant typically, I know this one is, and they're very fast. And so solid state drives are just great. The price has come down significantly on them. There's absolutely no reason to buy a spinning hard drive anymore unless you need very, very high capacity. But what's great about this is not only is it extremely small coming in at just under four inches in length, but it has that fingerprint scan. So when you have not scanned your fingerprint and you plug this in, it is in an encrypted mode. And if you plug it into a Mac or a PC, you get a folder with an application so that you can install and configure that. Alternatively, if your fingerprint is not working for some reason, having the application installed will allow you to enter a passcode, which is something that you're also going to choose during the setup process. So this can be unlocked with the passcode using software, and it can also be unlocked utilizing the fingerprint on the little pad here. So obviously nothing works unless you plug it in. This is gonna work on a Mac or a PC. It's going to work on Android phones, tablets, iPhone, iPad. It works across the board on pretty much everything. But I have found that it works a little bit better on a computer than it does on a tablet type of device or a smartphone. The application is available, like I said, when it's encrypted, when you plug it in, it's going to give you the application to install. The setup process is pretty easy. You go in and choose a passcode, and then once you do that, you have the option to add fingerprints. And it will support up to 10 fingerprints. So you can add maybe both of your thumbs. You can add a couple of other people that might need to access content that is on the solid state drive. And that way it uh, allows security across the board even if you were passing this solid state between different people. I love that option. So the application's easy to use. You do need a Mac or a PC for that. Now, like I said before, this is available in 512, one gigabyte or two gigabyte options. And the pricing isn't really that bad. Right now it's going to be launched as an Indiegogo project and they'll be available starting at $79.99. And then when they go retail, it's supposed to be about 40% more in price. So I definitely recommend grabbing one now on Indiegogo to get those savings. Now the read and write speeds are pretty impressive. They're definitely not high end read and write speeds, but you're gonna get uh, an advertised 540 megabytes per second, which is pretty fast. In my tests, I average about 450 megabytes per second, which is still really fast, but I did have other things connected to my MacBook Pro at the time that's definitely going to choke down that bandwidth a little bit, like an external display and two other external hard drives. So even under a load, you still are going to get fast read and write speeds out of this little drive. So a couple of closing thoughts. You definitely need to secure your content when you are carrying one of these little drives. You lose it, somebody plugs it in, they have access to everything. Our computers these days are encrypted pretty well with passwords and different uh, security features built in to keep people from accessing our content. But what about solid state drives or external hard drives? This is definitely a move in the right direction. Being able to unlock and lock uh, by simply using the fingerprint access, I think is absolutely fantastic. So it also comes with a USB-C to USB-C and a USB-C to USB-A cable. So whether you're using it with a modern device that has USB-C or something older with a little bit of a USB-A plug in it, you have cables for that. So this is an absolutely phenomenal little device. I've had their previous drives, the Vava drives that were not the touch, and they are really good drives. They're solid, they're fast, they're reliable, and I haven't had any problems with them yet. So I have no problem trusting the new Vava drives with the touch option. So definitely check out the link down in the description below. I like talking about new tech and things that excite me, and this definitely does. So check out that link and grab one for yourself today. But that's gonna do it for today. So I hope all is well with you. Make sure to click that subscribe button to subscribe to the channel, and we'll see you back in the next one. Take care.